So guys, in this tutorial, I will try to show you everything you need to know about masking in Filmora. It's really simple. Suppose we want to simply mask a person. For that, let's bring our clip to mask her. Go to right side, AI tools, enable AI portrait. See, her background is gone for the whole clip. Also, you can play with the edge thickness and the feather. Let's delete this clip. Now what if we want to mask an object? For that, select the clip, go to right side, mask. We have several options here. Let's try this new one, AI mask, brush size. Now if we draw on any object, the Filmora will try to detect the whole object automatically. Like this. See, only the car is selected. Let's delete this and try a new one. Suppose this object. Just draw over it. See, now delete this mask. Try the manual one, pen tool or draw mask. How to draw a complex character? The simple way, left click and put the points. Also, as you can see, we have a circular zoom in part to put the points accurately. So the car selection is done. But the problem here, we have some sharp pointy corners where it should be curved. So how to apply curve? Hold Alt, left click and drag that point. See? Same goes here. Alt, left click, drag. Then just position it. Now if we play it, as you can see our mask is not moving. To move the mask with the object, make a keyframe by clicking on this icon. Single left click. Zoom into timeline, move the playhead slowly, left click on the mask area, now reposition it. Left click, drag the points. Now if we move it, see the mask is moving with our object. Sometimes our object goes out of the screen like this. So how can we move the mask out of the screen too? We can zoom out in preview, single left click, zoom level, suppose 25%. See, now we can freely move our mask out of the screen. Also, we have some extra presets like the rectangle, circle or parallel line. We can use them to make a split screen like this, left click, drag, see, same for the linear. We can rotate it, place videos side by side. Also, we can reveal something by using the keyframe like this. Make a keyframe, move for two seconds, position the mask. See, cool transition. So guys, that's how easily we can use mask in Filmora. Thank you guys for watching. Have a good day.